Honor of Solace, new in theaters now. Daniel Craig plays Bond again, and I really like what they're doing with this. That uh, it seems like they're very slowly reintroducing some of the old Bond elements into it. Like you know, there's women back in the title sequence now, and uh, they're reintroducing what used to be uh, Spectre or Smirsh, um, depending on which film or book that you're looking at. And uh, they're showing that uh, Daniel Craig, uh, as Bond, is kind of growing into himself uh, in a way that he's, you know, he's becoming the more mature Bond. I, and I've actually heard it said from the producer team that they're, they're looking at this as kind of a trilogy, and at the end of the trilogy, he'll be kind of a whole man. He'll be Bond again. And... Um, I really like that. I really like that. I, I've heard complaints from a few critics that it's cut too fast and too close up, and I want to really disagree with that. That it's it's not like you know Transformers where when they're in the middle of a fight, all you can see is random bits of moving machinery. I think it's really well choreographed and really well shot, so that everything really is clear the entire time um, as to what's going on, even though it is faster paced. For your chance to win the new two-disc Blu-ray release of Casino Royale, just comment on any of the films we'll be reviewing on Butterflavored Minute. For official rules, check our blog at butterflavoredminute.com.